But with some, since we're on the topic of like the drama and all that shit, um, you were signed a black hand. Right. Who, and that's crazy. That 50? Yeah. Who shit playing? That's outside. What, what, what's their problem between y'all and 50 when he popped? It was never a problem. Because it was it was your manager he was talking about on Mini Men. It was. It was. Right. And um Wait, wait, it was who? Slim. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Right. Okay, yeah. okay, okay, yeah. I'm I'm a I'm a fast forward then rewind. Like when I did the you heard the So Brooklyn Freestyle I did? Yes. You heard that shit, right? In in the So Brooklyn Freestyle, I said, ignore whatever fifty cents say about him, right? And the whole internet Posted as a G Unit diss. Mm -hmm. Okay, I saw that. I yeah, yeah, that. I saw that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. It was either. never a diss. See, like, Chad, like for me, Chaz, me and Chad got our own relationship as grown men. He was almost like a more like a father to me than a, a, a manager. You know what I'm right. saying? And 50 has his own relationship with him. Right. Nobody can't nobody can't tell you about nobody got a relationship with. They got their own relationship. I got my own relationship with him. Right. My depiction of him is he's a real nigga. He's a gangster. He's official. I'm always gonna represent his legacy. To the wheels fall off. Right. That's who he is to me and to everybody that knows him. Right. It's a hundred, he's one of the most gangster niggas on the planet. Right. You know what I'm saying? 50, um, definition of him is going to be a little different. He had different experience. Whatever he experienced with him, he don't have the best things to say. Right. So when I said in the record, ignore whatever the fuck 50 say about him, I'm being literal. It's not a diss. I'm saying ignore what he says and don't let it, don't let it affect your opinion of Big Homie because he's official. Right. If you hear what 50 had to say about him, treat it as that's his opinion. He has the right to his own opinion. Everybody got the right to their own opinion. You know what I'm right. saying? I'm not mad at 50 for anything. Right. I don't even think 50 knows this, but nobody on that side is mad at him in, in a real way. Where, like they have an issue with him. It's, not, it's never been an issue. Even all the years when he was saying shit about Chaz, Chaz always spoke highly about the nigga behind closed doors. Right. So, and I, I never knew the real story between him and 50, because I never asked, because I felt like it wasn't my business. It wasn't, and I, I never knew 50 enough to really ask either. I just know 50 felt how he felt. It's you and the niggas felt how they felt. And it was what it was. Was there ever a conflict between y'all? Me and Fifth? You and G on the period. Um, not like in a real way, like we met up and fought or some shit. I mean, it was like tension and shit niggas say, because whatever the fuck was going on with the feelings affected my whole career. But whether like the hoodie said, oh, 50 blackballing you, 50 blackballing you. I don't know if he was blackballing directly. I just think all that energy that was going on was making niggas in yeah. the industry say, we gotta pick sides. Yeah, they, should, yeah, they pick sides. sides. Yeah. They did. They said, we gotta pick sides. Like, right sometimes it's not like a direct somebody calling, like, yo, don't yeah. fuck with them niggas. It's, exactly. it's just people That's knowing. I mean. Like, if you two guys you fuck don't get with along, this nigga. We gonna pick the nigga that's we're the biggest. Pick the nigga of course, that we, we gonna we try to make money off of. This you know nigga's I mean? diamond. He's helping us sell tickets. Yep. Spent all. Of, we going with this nigga. Right. Yeah. So and he, right now he feels if he's not cool with somebody, yep. it is what it is. Right. So he don't he he make you choose. You know what I'm saying? Without right. even saying it. So it, I don't think it was an issue. He was. That's in my personal opinion. Some niggas might say different, but I don't think he was personally trying to blackball. I think that's just niggas made a choice, and we got pushed to the side right. because they gonna rob a son. So whatever he felt about their relationship, he felt. He had the right to his opinion. I have nothing to say about that. I have nothing to do with that. I don't even know the story. Story. So I can't even really talk mm -hmm. about two grown ass men's relationship. That's not my place to do. You know what I'm saying? So right. Was their relationship uh, musically or like personal? Between me and Son? No, between uh, 50 and Slim. He used to manage him before he managed me. He used me. to manage him. Okay. Yeah. So whatever happened between the relationship yeah. happened. But I, all I know is that. Chaz had love for the nigga still. Right. To the end. He never was mad at 50. His energy carried on throughout the, like, the crew, per se, because niggas wasn't really mad at him. Even now on Instagram, I see certain niggas still liking the shit. I still like shit. I like the nigga, Fifth. I know, I, I know him. We never really kicked it, kicked it, but we, we cool enough pass. when we say what up. Yeah. He never was, I never had an issue with him. We're not enemies. Of right. course, I'm, I'm black hands, so I'm riding with the, with the team, but the team doesn't have an issue with you in a real way with beef. Right. Dad's one of the strongest niggas in the city. He was real beef, nigga. It, it would have it would have shown. It would have been something else. You know, have beef with a nigga being the same city for ten years and nothing happening. Okay. It, he never had an issue, and he never believed that son was ever black. Boy. So, so let's say you do a record with Lloyd Banks, ain't gonna be no fifty posts later. Like, look at these niggas. <laughs> you know what I'm I, I mean, that nigga plays chess. I have no fucking idea. Yeah, <laughs> I, I like Banks. I like. As a matter of fact, I I, I took. Cheap shot that Banks on some battle rap shit because I wanted to battle rap with the nigga to smack. So, to the camera yeah. round. Yeah. To the camera round. You heard it here first. Uh -huh. Rap versus Lloyd Banks. 
Boomtown. Next year, stay tuned. It's 2020. Starting here. Mike's for the pin. Going Let down. me tell you how that started, though. Because the nigga, <laughs> I, think he, I think somebody said to him on Instagram or Twitter that they want to see him in the ring. And he said, he said, battle who? Mad niggas tagged me in the shit or something like that, right? Is that what yeah. it was? You did that shit. One of my niggas jumped in the battle crap, he'll smoke you. Babes. And then I jumped in the like, I said, I, 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 I said, I don't think there's a rapper in the industry that, that could fuck with me in the ring. Y'all niggas is different. I ain't fuck with none of y'all niggas. Y'all niggas are <laughs> professional. Respect. Fuck out of here. <laughs> a rapper? Nah. I was like, nah, that's it. And the way, the way my brain think, right, as, uh-huh. a, as a street nigga and an artist, I'm like, whether I work with you or work against you, your energy is still going to propel me the same way. If you're my enemy or we're on a track together, it's the same momentum. So you choose, nigga, because I go any which way. I don't give a which fuck. Way, it's, right. I'm still going this way, dissing you or working with you. True, right. So that's how I look at shit. I'm like, okay, I could go at you or work with you. It's the same shit. Some people do the same, do it, um, right. do it one time. Um, I, heard, I heard something that uh, every, every feature that Papoose did, he, he disses. Person he's doing the feature. <laughs> niggas said they, they said it about a couple niggas. <laughs> nah, it's just something I heard. <laughs> nah, but I, 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 heard, I, I didn't understand where I, I heard it from. I used to hear that about a lot of rappers. But it was it was a valid opinion. So I was mm. like, word. I a couple of rappers was like that. I started listening. I, was I heard like, Jay no. was like that. A couple niggas I heard was oh, doing yeah. that type of yeah. shit. <laughs> I never seen that though. If I show, if I, if I it's show like love, it's always love. you do it because you just want to be better than the person. Nah, but you diss a nigga on the track with. I mean, not me. I show love to nigga. Fuck with. I diss a bunch of niggas. I don't like subliminals. If I'm dissing, I'm fucking dissing you. Yes. I don't do the middle ground shit. I like because. Me, I like to give, that's my personality, one, but two, I like to give niggas what I want to see. If you dissing somebody, I don't want to hear no subliminal shit. Nigga, who the fuck are you talking about? Say yes, say real shit. Name. Yeah, I, I like, it me as a fan of shit, secret word I can't fuck with early. Fuck that subliminal shit. But I'm you know who I think was always so good at that, and I loved it, Jay. Jay-Z, yeah. That Jay, nigga's a genius, and he's smooth with it. Make you out here. I'm not smooth. I'm trying to decipher man. this shit. Like, <laughs> who are you talking uh, uh, about? Because it's like, it's more powerful for me when Jay does it, a subliminal. Because it's almost Only like... Only Jay, though, because he's like Jay. Yeah. Not, it's almost like, you're not I got some Jay stories I'm going to tell you off camera, too. Like, okay. If I say camera? your name, your worth doubles. Yeah. But this I ain't going to uh, say your name. So now, I, mean, you're, you're I like right. that shit. You know what I mean? I ain't saying, but you name no more. I'm about a dollar. Who the fuck, fuck is 50 it. cents? Take a page out that of was like a but that was for 50. That, that was, was like, clear. that was clear. <laughs> it's kind of like, clear. perfect example, like, I never had a beat for 50, right? Right. But if he ever said my name in a foul way or made fun of me or whatever the fuck, I might just be like, thank you, nigga. Because <laughs> so, all your fans, I'm going to go crazy yeah. on you. But yeah, I'm going to yeah, go crazy yeah. on you for your fans. Yeah. Right. You never heard of me. Right. So it's throwing me the crazy alley open. I'm going to catch that shit. That's right. Yeah, but that's why it's I, good But that's how he thinks too. As a huge artist, like a, because it's like, why would I? Make so it? I, I get Jay Z for that line. If you if you say my name, I imagine like if Fifty posted me crazy or said it, like no matter, wh- no matter what, what you say, right. it's gonna make your fans be like, who that? Who that? Right. Right. I'm gonna take that layer like, who I'm going crazy. I'm like, they all looking at me, right? Yes, now? <laughs> I'm, I'm going crazy. crazy. I think that's why I hope was over subliminal, because yes. he was mindful of what type of attention he would draw to certain Absolutely. people. Smart. So if you knew, you knew. Yeah. But the dumb, yeah. dumb niggas, it was a hot ride. When, when you were yes. that successful, you were like a mini genius. 50, Puff, Jay, them niggas mm. is far from stupid. You yeah, don't right. get that successful winging it. Yeah. Right. Them niggas know they power. Please say believe it. Your name you know what I'm saying? If he say your name, a million dollars. it's beyond Disney. Unless he think you dead already, he don't give a fuck. But if he, if he, <laughs> If you're, on the, if you're on the same level as him, they probably don't care. But if you're down here, like if I'm here trying to climb up, he's here, he's not doing you. That's a life raft. Basically. Like, yeah, but, but he didn't even do that with people that was like, like, we know he did Prodigy. We know he did Rest in Peace. We know he did Small Beat. Small uh, Beat. He did but he never said their names. But after the, after the deal? Um, what you call it? In, on... On um, ROC, we running this rap. Take my J, I'm the right. Oh, I he definitely did. We know he said their name. Them. Right, right, right. But he didn't but say their name. But Jay he invented that name? shit. He invented that slick talk of some little yeah. shit. Yeah. Who the fuck was doing that before that? He invented I that think shit. He was. He's just the greatest at it. Who was that nigga's a that? genius with it. And Drake, I think, took a page out of his book. Super. Oh, he's, Drake is he's, great with subliminal shit. Oh yeah. But his subliminals be like. Crap down a block, made a right. It's on sight. Like that whole scheme is. Fire. Checks on the strikes. What are you talking about, Kanye? When we heard about um, Puff snuffing Drake. Oh, yeah, that was crazy. I got out of the public. Everybody was like, was that real? Yeah, that was out. Did that happen? I know that was was public. Oh, okay. That was real? It was public. We don't know. From what I heard. We don't know. We physically put hands on it. If it's actually real. So it's a legend now. 
Yo, Yo, so Pump a gangster on the low. But yeah. who <laughs> you going for? But what kind of solidified is Pump trying to check you. I, no, no, I know. But what solidified is You can't be that rich and be pussy. It's Drake not a can be. You bugging. It's mad. Them niggas is pussy as shit. I'm saying, pump your head shit, though. Yeah, I'm probably pay that money. If I was that rich, I'm like, y'all put 80 grand on your head. Shut up. Go fucking talk to me. He put a million on somebody with Keefy D. Remember Keefy D said he put. This is on black TV, man. Keefy D went on black TV. Listen, he went on black TV. He went on black TV, my nigga. Made it public and said, yo, Puff offered niggas a million dollars. Who? Who's that? Keefy D, the one who supposedly said his his nephew killed Tupac? He said that? He said that. He said He said his nephew was the one he said it to the feds. This shit is out. I don't I don't I, I, he said, know, wow. he said know, Orlando. I, I know that Vlad pays people for Regardless if he paid it. Depending Ooh, on what he didn't tell Vlad this. He wow. actually said it uh, like uh, while he was getting, like while the cops had him in the room. They recorded him. He said, yeah, yo. He came by that. around, Pac, shot him, all that. I he, saw that he said but everything. I that was bullshit. What's the nigga name? Yeah. Uh, Keefy D, which was Orlando. Uh, I'm like, the dude, that. Tupac punched in the, what you call it? He said this shit was all gang shit. He said he punched him. He wanted to head with Pac. Niggas wasn't. So he's, they came back around, they get shot up the car, they kept it pushing. He talked so, about the whole so shit. With the Puff, I ain't Puff, I ain't no, no before that, Puff was already beefing with them niggas. And he was cool with one of Puff's mans. And Puff said, I'll put a million up, whoever take care of the situation type shit. Nice. And niggas was like, niggas was like, niggas was like, word? Type shit, and then that happened around that time. So that's why they always link Puffy. So let's do this. My nigga, no, 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 Uncle Murder said, "Yo, this nigga Puffy, I'm not fucking with Puff because he already no, killed. No, he got no, pot killed." No, so before you say that, answer the question. I'm so nigga, saying this is the, all public. The views, the views and opinions of knowledge <laughs> <laughs> do not. These ain't my opinions. Show. My views. They are his own. <laughs> These are facts. You can look up. <laughs> this kid, I know nothing about this. Never heard it before. You never heard of none <laughs> no, of this shit? No, no, no. I you haven't. know what's crazy, though? That's crazy. I never heard it before either, but if that's true, then them niggas had a million dollar offer and killed the nigga for free? Yeah, basically. That's what he said. Because he said he never got the bread. God damn. He said Puffy never that's paid him. That's a rip-off? And he said... <laughs> <"Man>, <laughs> you looked this up for that's crazy. Yeah. I never heard you know, that though. I'm dead. I'm gonna that. I never heard nah, that. Nah, shit. I'm not saying it's Nah, nah, go on. Nah, nah, it's out there. Nah, but the fact that he's saying it's not what I'm talking about. Don't stop doing it. Don't do that. Don't do that. We're going to edit this. We're not going to edit it, but you know. The fact that they're saying that in this way and they're not doing anything. Yeah. Then what does that mean? Yo, police don't find nobody with a rap. I'm just saying, because I said Puffy's a gangster, and I was just adding that on to show how gangster he is. Think about like, if you rap and you get <laughs> shot, you, you there's a killer, the killer's got free. You ain't on. You're gonna solve that man, shit. Police ain't solving no rap murders, nigga. I'm just gonna be nah, that's mad. real. Rest in peace, Nipsey. Nobody gonna help. Nipsey. Absolutely. Yeah. Oh, man. I still have my own conspiracy theories about yeah, that. Yeah, though we ain't gonna do that shit. You know what I mean? Word. Rest in peace, Jay. Rest in peace, Jay. In general, though. How many rappers die by gun violence? And, and they never saw Police them. don't do a motherfucker. That's real. Thing. That's real talk. About he rapped and put a I'm, fucking. I'm sure the statistics is retarded on that. Just think about it. Think of all the rappers that, that, that fell victim to the hammer and who went to jail for it. Unsolved, most of them shits. Right. Not all of them. At least the ones we. The, mic, the the magnifying glasses on, the ones that I see on. Most of them. I don't really see I think nothing. Chris Rock or Dave, uh, Dave Chappelle said if you want to kill anybody, get away with it, just put a mixtape in his pocket. <laughs> That's a fact. You know yeah. 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 Just put That's a mixtape in the nigga pocket. Are you the rapper? Get away I'm with it. Clean. Hey. Says a rapper? <laughs> Open the shut case. Hey. 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 drug related. Yeah. 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 Sucks, bullshit walks in. Talk sheep, so it just won't cut it. Dog that with them blue stripe hunters. Niggas front it, look, look how we on it. Money talk, bullshit walks in. Talk sheep, so it just won't cut it. Dog that with them blue stripe hunters.